Do you know what? I'd like to slag off the black country before I go. <laughs> Anyone in from the black country? <laughs> Which part? Where are you, where are you from? Wolverhampton, all right. <laughs> Yeah, that's how they talk. If you don't know the black country, they talk like, they talk like, that I got now, neck and now future. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Have you travelled from Wolverhampton? I live in London now. I love it. It's, I really find it pleasing to hear the accent. Have you been to the um, Ikea in Wensbury? I have. You have? Right, why? when you get to the checkout, I agree, yeah. Well, it's stressful in that one because it's full of people from the black country and they're all mad ads. <laughs> Listen, I, right, I, was in the, um, I was in the kitchen area when I went round and there was a family walking round and the dad of the family said this very loudly because I wasn't that nearby and I heard it very clearly. He went, look at that chopping board. I couldn't chop me cock on that. <laughs> Is that a requirement of a chopping board that I've missed? <laughs> Bless you. Well, thanks for coming along. I do, and this is the thing, I slag off the black country loads it's because I love it and it's, I've got loads of friends there, I spend a lot of time there. I went on a speed awareness course in the black country. Have people been on speed awareness courses? Yeah, yeah some other bad boys. Um, I thought it was really effective, but my favourite thing about it is this woman at the back who just did not give a shit. She's like, my new spirit animal, she's just there like, oh, Rog. And the guy came out and he was proper patronising. He was like, guys, guys, just shout out reasons. Why do we speed? Why do we speed? Why do we speed? And she went, because I'm in a rush. <laughs> Good, good, you're in a rush, you're in a rush. Great, great. Why do we rush? Why do we rush? Why do we rush? Because I need a piece. <laughs> Realised very quickly he did not want to be talking to her. He was trying to get anyone else to chip in. At one point he forced this quite meek guy at the front to chip in. It was really sweet. He said, you've got two options. Have you got two options? You can go by the speed limit or you can go to jail. Do you want to go to jail? He hadn't been listening, he just went, yes. Any reasons why it's justifiable to speed, why we might be okay to speed? She went, well, if there's an emergency, if you've got to take someone to hospital? He went, no, that's not a reason, is it? It's not a reason. You've still got to be safe, haven't you? Still got to be safe. If you hit someone on the way to hospital, that's two people going to hospital, isn't it? She went, that's lucky, I'm going that way, give him a lift. <laughs> Everything she said, I'll leave you on this. It was terrible, it was brilliant. He said at the end of the session, he's like, any other reasons why we speed that we've not covered? Any other reasons? No one chipping in, I wasn't chipping in. In the end, she just went, well, because it's fun. <laughs> and we went, yeah, yeah, it's, yeah, it's fun, isn't it? It's fun to speed, isn't it? It's fun to speed. Do you know when it's not fun? When you kill a child. <laughs> Everyone went quiet, and then she just went, depends on the child. <laughs> Love her. <laughs>